Golf Bite Online product testing. Today we're looking at uh, the Torpeferd Tailor Made Irons. Uh, there comes uh, three different types of head. You've got the CB, you've got the MC, and you've got the MB. Who would like to have a little look um, at all the heads? The MB being the bladed one. You see from there, no cavity on there at all, more of a muscle back iron. You've got the very thin sole and the, the thin top leading edge. Very nice looking club, more suited to the low handicap as I would have thought. Uh, you've got the weight there in the back of the head. Um, it's a forged iron, so being for uh, lo a lot of feel, uh, the, the, like I said, the lower handicappers who like to play the, the playability, hit the draw shots, hit the fade shots and uh, get the right feel around the greens or maybe the long irons into the greens. Um, in this club we've got an S300 uh, Dynamic Gold which is one of the shafts that come in this club. Um, we've got the standard tailor-made um, tall velvet grip on there. Nice looking club. Um, I would have thought the ball flight would be quite low, being the weight very close to the face, more penetrating flight. So maybe someone who plays around a Lynx course, who's off quite a low handicap, maybe ranging from about 8 to scratch. Um, this would be suitable to keep the ball under the wind. Um, but a very nice looking club to start off with. You've then got the MC, which is... Uh, bit more of a cavity in the back there still got the weight there for the to keep the ball down it's more center in that in that face uh, get the right penetrating ball flight you can see there still quite a thin sole it's very playable iron again um, nice thin top edge this runs alongside the M, the MB which I just showed you you can have a combo set so say you like uh, the thinner looking head um, from a pitching wedge maybe to a 7 iron or a pitching wedge to 8 iron you can then have these in the longer irons a bit easier to hit obviously with a little bit of a cavity again this shaft comes with a dynamic gold S300 very nice shaft again we've got the tailor made tall velvet golf pride grip on it very nice feeling grip again back to the head it's a forged head so you're not going to lose any feel even though that you've got the cavity in there but it uh, just gives you that probably a bit more confidence of hitting the ball the, the sole of the club's not as thin as that uh, MB I just showed you okay moving on <clears throat> to the CB look there quite a deep cavity there if I stick my finger inside again the weight more to the bottom of the club face now trying to encourage that high ball flight with along with the deep cavity again this is a forged iron so you're getting the feel from a playable club so maybe this iron's targeted at the higher handicappers very nice chrome finish see if you see all three of these together that's that uh, CB on the end there is uh, got the most chrome finish look um, out of the three of them whereas the MB's got more of a dull finish and the MC again quite a nice chrome finish all very nice looking irons again the CB comes with the dynamic gold R300 all clubs are available um, with different shaft options which are available on our website um, we'll just give three of them a go, see how they feel. Firstly, I'll try the CB, the higher handicap club. Look, I'm, what I'm looking for uh, from this, just to feel, see how uh, the ball flight reacts. I'm looking probably from this club, I'm going to get quite high ball flight. <clears throat> quite a bit, of it, quite a bit more distance than the other two irons, as this uh, quite forgiving. This one here, the CB. So again, let me just show you, got the deep cavity here, heel toe weighted for the off centre strikes. Like I said, very forgiving. At setup, I can see the leading edge, quite thick, quite clumpy. Um, 
again, like I said, for the higher handicappers who like that clumpy club, gives them a bit of confidence in striking the ball. So just hit one, see how it goes. Quite high ball flight. Nice feel off the club face. Wasn't a great swing, but still didn't have no shock through the hand. And uh, the, the resulting ball flight and the distance was very good for uh, a, not, a, not the greatest swing in the world. <clears throat> okay, I'm trying the MC now. Uh, a little bit of a less of a cavity than the, uh, the previous iron, but um, again, it's got the cavity unlike the, uh, the MB. But I'll just give this one a go as well, see how it goes. <clears throat> okay, already I can see that uh, the leading edge is uh, a lot uh, slimmer than the previous iron I tried. So I'll give it a go, see how it feels. Nice looking club. Still quite a high ball flight which is what you want in the longer irons. It lands softly on the green, you're attacking a pin. But um, great feel from the face, it feels very solid as the weight's very close. I'll just show you again, <clears throat> in the CB, the weight's a little bit lower in the club face than the MC. This is closer to the face, more penetrating ball flight, and great feel. Lastly, we go on the MB. Again, like I said uh, previously, the MC here, they run um, as a combo set, which again you can see online um, what mix and match you can have. The, this here is probably better to have the, the longer irons in the, uh, in the MC, as uh, again, like I said, the cavity is a little bit deeper <clears throat> resulting in a, a little bit more forgiveness and the, the heel toe weight in again the off centre strikes uh, you're going to have that little bit more forgiveness whereas in this iron here aimed at the lower handicappers who really like to move the ball for that penetrating ball flight and uh, minimum forgiveness okay just going to try it see how, what the difference is between this and the MC Okay, so very, very thin leading edge. Quite a small head. Notice the difference straight away. Looks very inviting to hit. Great looking club. Uh, with the XPS 300 shaft. Let's, uh, let's give it a go, see how it goes. Much lower ball flight. It's gone a little bit shorter than the deeper cavity on the CB. So look at these two irons again against each other. That's the higher, higher handicappers one here. That's the lower handicappers one there. This one, the CB went slightly longer than the MB. Feeling quite not as good, but the forgiveness is there. Like I said, my the swing I put on that club wasn't brilliant, but I still got the result I wanted. But the, the MB, again, like I said, minimal forgiveness, but a great looking club, and the feel is superb.